Hey guys, Gossip and Reactions, Maurice Take. This OnlyFans broke up with her boyfriend and the boyfriend ended up set her house on fire, killing her mother and injured her daughter. Again, guys, black women are making some choices that make no sense. And as a black woman myself, I would rather be by myself than being with a fool that you don't know what to expect from them. For somebody to commit such crime, and before he committed the crime, he tweeted a few things. You think you're lonely now? That's one of the phrase he put down. And then be without a mother. And later on, set the house on fire. And looking at the guy and you wonder, was there any sign this guy was mentally not stable? That's one thing. And why dealing with somebody that cannot take rejection? Why a certain woman would prefer to be with a pookie, with a foolish man, instead of being by yourself, get to know yourself, look for the right guy. Because when you go with those crazy fools, you pay their bills, they live with you, they don't have to work hard. Now, right a certain, now you have a little bit of money, you want to kick them out, or they're going to get revenge. Of course, it's not the right thing to do. But some fools, some losers are not used to rejection. They don't know how to take it. To so being living in a house with AC 24-7, eat, play game, all right? Only fan model is handling the bills, taking care of business, and wake up the next day, you out, get out of my house, and that fool don't even know what he's going to do, or he's going to seek revenge, and he's going to take the most precious thing you've had, and you are suffering right now. The only thing you can say, I hate you, I effing hate you, but that will never replace your mother, the person who gave birth to you. You should have seen the sign. You should have seen the crap for what it is. Guys like this are not worth it. Have somebody sleeping next to you. I would rather be alone with my kids knowing there was no threat. There was no fools that are going to destroy me or my kids. Now the child is in a hospital. Hopefully she get a speedy recovery. You lost your mother for what? For a steak that's not even worth it. This man has nothing to live for. And my thing is, before those idiots commit those crimes, knowing they'll be in jail for life, do they even give two fly F about their own lives? No. If they have nothing going for them, they have a bad record, they cannot find a job, they don't have what to live for, they don't care about life itself, do you think they will care of not going to jail, spending their whole life there? They don't care. And it is so easy now for those fools to get a gun. These idiots cannot even pay bills for themselves to have a place. But they are able to purchase guns with bullets. The bullets need to be more expensive. The bullets in the gun supposed to be sky high. Because if you allow a fool that cannot pay bills to sleep in a stable place. But can buy a gun to take somebody's life. Come on man. What's up with that? What's up with that? Again, the only fan lost her mother. Her child is in the hospital now. And you can hear from her voice that she's suffering. She's homeless. Don't have a place to go because you were dealing with the wrong man. Sometimes it is okay to be by yourself. Not having that disgusting stick sleeping next to you one day and the next day they can kill you. Okay? It is unfortunate we have heard those stories over and over because women are not choosing carefully. Just because the men smile at you, say, hey, babe, don't mean he's worth to be taken home to. He could have taken your child's life. He's taken your mother's life. You could have been gone also if you were in a house. He doesn't care. To him, the only thing he sees is revenge. You've been dead. All you've loved being gone. And he did that. It is unfortunate. And I hope women can learn. We have seen so many young men from 8 to 12 are dying because they are trying to protect mom from the monster. Mom, stop being dealing with this foolishness. Be by yourself. Wait. 
try to find the right guy instead of find some fool that's not worth it that is willing to take your child from you willing to take you they don't care for themselves they don't care for you they don't care for your kids life they have nothing to live for why are you scooping so low why you go down so low trying to make it trying to make people see you have a man i would rather be by myself than being with a foolish man he has nothing to give me he has no future he is not a po oh, god he's not good he's garbage He's not a protective, a, 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 a great man to society. He belongs in jail. Why he has to take somebody's life before he's in the cage? He should have been in jail. That's where he belongs. Enough is enough with us women finding the wrong man just to be pleased for a second or two. It's not worth it. Enough is enough. Too many young men are dying trying to protect mom from dying from these fools. Now mom are dying. She could have been killed. Why? For what? The minute the person sit down and have a conversation with you, you can tell if they have something in their brain, something not right. They missing a screw. Some kind of thing is not right. They are not productive human beings to society. That's the word I was trying to look for. I could not find it. They are not productive human being to society they will stop at nothing to take your life or the people you love so why dealing with them and you paying the bills Shh, man please you paying the bills and he threatened to take your life your mom's life and your child's life and he succeeded because you did not kick him out early enough oh he's gonna change he's a good man he got a great heart Oh, please, when you're dealing with monster, you're dealing with monster. I would rather be happy by myself with my kids than dealing with a fool that can take my life the next day. I want to breathe. If it's my time to go, God take my life, that's fine. He gave me life. But to allow another human being to take my life because I allowed him to be next to me sleeping in the bed. And when I no longer want them taking my life, it's not worth it, sisters. It's not worth it. Subscribe. Let me know how you feel. Thank you for watching, y'all. Bye.